Well, good morning. This morning our scripture is found in John chapter 20, verse 27, and it goes like this. Then saith he to Thomas, Reach hither thy finger, and behold my hands, and reach hither thy hand, and thrust into my side, and be not faithless, but believing. You know, doubt is a human condition. Yes, we all have doubts sometimes. And uh, like old Thomas, I mean, he was eat up with doubt, wasn't he? He certainly was. Yeah, you know, and he got hung with that name, Doubting Thomas. Now, I don't know, but I am pretty sure that a lot of us, including me, at some, some time or another, we have doubts. Yeah, we do. Unfortunately, there's millions upon millions of doubters, just like Thomas, in the world today. Doubt can bring on fear. Did you know that? Yep, sure can. And, you know, many, many folks doubt if there is a God. They just can't comprehend it. And generally speaking, the what I've found, uh, the highly educated, that's the ones that really doubts the most. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And many, many doubts about eternal life. You know, that, that Jesus actually died on the cross for sins. He paid the ultimate cost. And all we have to do is accept him. Yet they doubt that that really happened. And that, that really works. You know, many doubts that God cares for them, but he does. He had to care for you. He sent his only begotten son to die on the cross for you and I. He sure does. Many doubts if God hears our prayers. Well, now, sometimes when we do pray, it seems like there's a brass ceiling. That's what we think, but he hears our prayers. He hears our prayers. I don't care what condition you're in. He hears our prayers. He certainly does. Isaiah 41 and 10 says, Fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee. Yea, I will help thee. Yea, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. So don't be doubting if God loves you. Don't be doubting if God doesn't care for you. Don't doubt. No, don't be that doubting Thomas. Believe. And the more you read the word of God, the less doubt you'll have, the less fear you'll have in your life. Well, I hope and pray this encourages someone today. Don't be no doubting, Thomas. No. Believe. See with your spiritual eyes. Yeah, God loves you and he cares for you. May God richly bless you. I love you, but better yet, Jesus loves you. He died on the cross for us, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye now.